Hi, this is Andy Fisher with Dolby Laboratories, and I'm here with John Harris, who is a broadcast music mixer, and we're here at the rehearsals at Grammys, and we're going to ask him a few questions. Hi, John. Hi. Um, why don't you tell a bit, us a little bit about what your role is here, what you do here during all through the preparation between the rehearsals and the actual live event? Sure. We're, um, Eric and I share the duties as uh, music mixers for the show. The show generally has two things that, uh, uh, events that happen on the show. One is, are the awards that everybody is uh, nominated for. And somebody will win and those presentations uh, are the, the founding point of the show. But uh, along with those, and kind of the most fun part of it for, for a lot of people, since they don't win a Grammy, is the, are the performances. People who are nominated will perform their nominated songs on the show. So to do that, um, over time we have evolved to a point where Tom Holmes, our uh, A1 uh, main audio uh, point downstairs, will handle the presentations and play-ons and uh, uh, things like that. And when it comes time for, to, for a performance, we will appear on his console as an element of his console and be the musical part of the broadcast. And those mixes are very similar to a record mix as, as much as we can, but in other words, we're, we mic all the instruments individually and create as full uh, and, and good sounding a, a performance mix as we can. To, but the show is live. It's live, live, and there's no going back, so we need a lot of rehearsal. And so in these days prior, we're two days out from the show now, uh, in, in our second day of rehearsal, each act will be set, lit, all the set pieces and all the instrumentation and all the lighting will be set and we'll rehearse those songs uh, several times. Uh, and for our part, um, rather than just be satisfied at the end of camera rehearsal with that mix, we record it onto our Pro Tool systems multi-track recorders and uh, it is treated differently. It, it, it is treated as just a recorder. I'm sorry, I should back up. Pro Tools is capable of doing many things. You could be a recorder, you could be a mixer, you could do many things with it. Um, in our case, we, we assign machines to be recorders and machines to be mixers. So the, mi the recorders next door will record the show flat, uh, right from the mic preamps to the A to D converters, boom, it's recorded. Now the output of that recorder comes to my desk and all the EQ and compression and panning and real presentation, the mix of the, of the song is created there. And like I, was, like I said, at the end of camera rehearsal, I've only heard it a couple of times or maybe three, four times. And, and while that might pass, we'd rather do it better. We'd rather raise the bar and do it as well as it could be done. So to accomplish that, we have our sister truck, I'll call it, um, that we're in here now that lives here in California that has identical electronics, <coughs> acoustics, uh, everything uh, very similar to the original broadcast truck. And uh, a network is created of the audio and the uh, sessions that make up the console and the, and the mix so that immediately following the recording of the rehearsal, I can come over to this location in this, this mirrored control room and sit down with a little more relaxed, have the artist come in, sit down, <coughs> excuse me, their producer, whatever, and sit down and really refine it. So well, I'd like a little more of this, change the reverbs, change whatever we want to change, and really make it present the way we would like it to be on TV. And then we'll store it here and it'll go back onto the server and become part of the show, the queue for the show. And uh, so now uh, we just finished Rihanna's rehearsal and, and I came over here and refined that mix a little with her producer and now it'll go back on over there. We'll continue this process for two more days. And then once uh, dress rehearsal comes, we're all standing in show mode and Max will have lined up the artists in order of performance and we'll start with those mixes created here and see how it goes and, and see whether we're all happy with every aspect, all the lighting guys and we and, and everyone, <coughs> and then make a jump. 